Ooh, about to get into these past notes, ladies and gentlemen. There's a lot of them, though. Hey, babe, can you bring me something to drink, please? All right, thanks, sweetie. Patch notes. Yes. I know you end up watching the game. Bring me something. Really, nigga? It's just a cup. What happened to ice? Uh -huh. How you gonna even ask me, do I want some ice? Yeah. Bruh. Really? I tell you I was watching the game. Okay. This is just ice, though. Can I get something to drink? Then I ask you for hey, something. Man. Damn, you want small pieces at a time? Nasty! Well, damn! So let me watch my fucking film! I didn't choose! We love the music! Yes! Don't get it confused, I'm working, but homie, I still murk you, come on! We'll never lose! Yes, sir! What's going on, everybody? It's your boy, Jay Easy, a.k.a. Fresh from the Barbershop, BK of the People's Town, coming to you live. Full disclosure, your boy. I mean, hey, look, I don't read well out loud, man. I read to myself. I mean, that's, that's how I got through engineering. But don't, don't worry about all that damn. Anyway, check it out. Uh, Check it out. NBA 2K17 update patch 1.05 now out. Full patch notes provided. Um, I don't think y'all want me to hit all these patch notes. I think we know know the major thing, but we just gonna go through it. Uh, HDR support has been added for PS4. I support PS4, blah, 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 blah. blah. Cleveland Cavaliers floor been fixed. Uh, let me see. The, the Golden State Warriors uniforms. Like, we don't, are we, are we really worried about stuff like that? Why are we worried about stuff like that? Authenticity improvements to a large number of uniforms. What? Really? Is this game, okay, okay we are gonna keep rolling though. Uh, you can now post, post, uh, you can now use post release uniforms. On in 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 play now, huh? Okay, that's cool. Uh, post release shoes. It will now dramatically will now dynamically appear in your in your. Are we gonna get Yeezys? No, we're not getting Yeezys. Okay, cool. Uh, users now have the ability to toggle on and off uh, the paint zoom camera. Blah blah blah. What what what? Okay, I'm trying. I'm still trying to get to something that makes sense, man. Fixing an issue where the user is unable to to unequip certain animations to their model. Okay, so my part dunks is that's I guess that's my part dunks. Hopefully, hopefully that's what it is. You can unequip, unequip my part dunks so so brute can play with his. That's probably one of the first things that I even really care about. Uh, the user can now unequip socks. Okay, and addressing an issue where controller settings would uh, reset after. After play on, hey dog, if you think I believe that controller settings are fixed, where it's, where it's not gonna keep going back to uh absolute, man, that's been happening since forever. So I mean, it's gonna keep going back to camera relative. I don't believe that. All right, let's get down to gameplay. We just, I'm just trying to buzz through this as quickly as I, as I possibly can, man. Uh, user will no longer be able to prolong. My that was the thing you could just keep fouling somebody and prolong the game. Well, that sucks. Jamal Crawford double behind the back. Okay, Jamal Crawford works. That's cool right there. Aiming and shooting is much easier in broadcast. That's probably something that's big for those guys. Something I don't really care about that you can aim and shoot with the stick and broadcast a little bit easier. But okay, okay that's cool. Uh, disable shot timing for all shots, uh, including layups, hooks, floaters, and heaves when this, when when shooting percent. Okay, that should have been what. That should have been like that anyway. Like if you're using the player percentage rather than rather than time, and why why would why would time and even matter? Like these are the things that I'm talking about that 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 are issues with this game. Like nobody tested this stuff, man. But you know it is what it is. Dial back dial back pass speeds, especially on longer passes. Okay, that's cool. You just you're still not gonna be able to intercept passes, and the ball still not gonna be tangible. So we're not even worried about that. I uh, reduce frequency of of ticky tack fouls. Like who cares? Like. If the ball goes in, it doesn't even matter if I foul them. I guess that might work matter in like my team or something like that. But on the park, we we play park most of us, so I, I guess like play now and in my team that'll re that will really matter. Like if he made the layup, why why is it called a foul every single time? I guess I can understand that. But in the park, we really don't care. And probably in pro am that that matters a lot too. So I I can I can, I can understand that. Fix the legal screens. Uh, they say they fixed the legal screens. We're gonna test that out in a later video coming up, man. But they say fix the fix moving screens. They said they fixed moving screens. That was straight from the desk of Mike Wong. Say they fixed the moving screens, so you know it is what it is. General improvement to responsibility, primarily in off-ball motion. 
Okay, so maybe you can defend people a little bit better. They're saying they fix defense and the off-ball moves work. Like, like I like to grab people and chuck people and stuff. So if that improved, that's cool. Improve the, uh, the CPUs, team logic, and general defensive AI decision making. That'll be cool, man. I've seen the Sam Fam video about how the computer always make just you know just always makes the, the wrong decision regardless of the sense that you put on them. So that'll be cool. And then like when somebody gets kicked out of the game. I don't need the computer to double down or do anything. Just defend your man, computer. That's all I really care about. Address visual issues that will sometimes cause uh, hook shots to branch into jump shots. What? Following landing. Okay. Like, stuff like that. Like, again, how does this make it out of testing? I don't understand. Like, people don't play the game. They need to get some people down there or really start watching people's channels that actually play the game. Dog. Like, I don't understand how this got released and... It, how the game got re released in this condition, and then here we go to uh, 2K, uh, uh, Park and Pro Am. Um, team and teams in River City are are again able to grab a got next spot while the game is in process. Okay, well that's cool. I mean, do we why why would you be able to grab got next when when you know why? Because nobody want to have next, right? Okay, fix the hang that occurred with some users uh, when 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 they were hopping from my part from one part to another okay that's cool i mean i, I really didn't notice they fixed a number of camera related issues shooting free throws and pro -am. okay so they, they fixed the, the timeout cheese that's what that's they could have just put that timeout cheese has been restored okay that's cool address an issue where some some users were unable to use the custom jump shots in my part so you can actually use your custom jump shot in my part we already had done a video on how you can do that anyway so we already knew that like i said we out here testing your game for you fixing your game for you until they well me and Man Man, we was talking the other day, and we was like, yo, we actually made, between he and I, we made this game playable until they actually fixed the stuff. So, you know, hey, hey, shout out to Man Man. Shout out to your boy. Shout out to me. All uh, right, so you can use your mouse and it won't glitch out again either. When editing the Pro-Am court, the backboard uh, logo and wall texture can now be switched. Like, like, okay, cool, that's cool. Uh, you can now view the team's roster of each team directly from the power rankings. Okay, that's cool. That's something if, I, if I'm playing a lot of Pro-Am, I, I think I would want to do that. All, t all of your teams will now have a unique color indicator when uh, playing Pro-Am. I thought it was already blue and red, but I could be wrong. You know, I, I never really pay attention. Grand badges will now appear on the NBA, on the 2K card. That's cool. So, you know, when you're jumping, you know, when you're getting on the court and you're looking at somebody's badges, you can actually see what badge they have before you play them because you can already see their... Um, you can already see their um, their record and stuff like that, so that'll be cool. My court, you can now skip through uh, story cutscene. Thank you. This is the number one reason why it always takes me so long to create another character because I don't want to watch these cutscenes all the time. I just want to skip through them because this is what I do. Sometimes when I make a character, I want to go in and put several different variations of the character. I make several different variations or several different ones until I get the attributes that I really like. And it was taking like 30 minutes to do it each time because I had to go through uh, the coach scene and, and watch Kobe do his thing. So that'll be great right there. I can actually do that. Uh, fixed an issue where, fixed an issue that would result in, in the user being unable to play the next uh, game in my career. What they thought? I thought that they already fixed that. Okay, maybe they did fix the case where some users were were not seeing triggered uh, story scenes. I didn't see a lot of story scenes because my girl never broke up with me and I never got hurt in any of my seasons. So maybe that's what it was. I also didn't get the Mike Jordan court. I ain't getting none of this stuff, man. It is what it is. Fixing an issue where where some of my career sponsors contract were not rewarding the user. With <clears throat> with the correct amount of VC, you damn right. Because I've been playing and I've been um I've been hooping all this season with my second character. Dog, I only been getting like 50 VC uh per meeting or, or anything that we do. I haven't been getting any. And I know what my I thought they had just nerfed the VC. But with my first character, I was getting two, three thousand VC a meeting. So hey, that'll be that'll be do uh that'll be great. Uh correcting an issue where where you could not purchase equipped shoes. Uh, from your new company when switching shoe endorsements. Okay, that's cool. I mean, I'm not worried about that. Address an issue where the phone in my career would inform you that the user of a new message, inform the user of a new message when that was not the case. I never experienced that, so that's cool. I mean, it's glad, I'm glad that they fixed it for them, but you know it is what it is. Fix the case where the player would, would get stuck in the line during the free throw golf drill. The free throw golf drill, what? Live practice when using specific signature animations never happened to me. 
if, if it happened to y'all, y'all let me know. And then last but not least, uh, points of emphasis have been returned to the game plan uh, game plan feature. No, but okay, we're not worried about that. Uh, the next, uh, by the way, all these down in the description, man. You just click on the link and it'll be down there. The advanced rotation feature uh, will now scale rotations. Uh, what? I don't even, <laughs> let me see. Fix the case where some approved city names like this is like my league and gm so i guess this is something that i really don't even know about don't care about fixing issue where the player attributes were being slightly modified when loading a draft class okay i can see how that would be. injuries will not occur during head-to-head -head gameplay in my league hey that's cool i mean I, I think that's cool man when you're simulating or when you're playing by yourself but head-to-head -head, you should never really get an injury i don't think but you know it is what it is color improvements have have been made to the Kansas City Knights uniform. That's cool. Film the hang, film, uh, fix the hang where that would occur when attempting to use Simcast on the Rising Stars game. Huh? Okay. And uh, let me see. Expansion teams will no longer get unlimited funds. And my G, I mean, that, how, how does that make it out of testing, though? Like, I'm really, really wanting to know, like, how stuff like this makes it out of testing. But it is what it is. And the NBA logo is now located in the correct spot on the shorts when creating cut. Oh my God! Like nobody noticed that. Anyway, man, like I said, the only thing I really cared about is that they said they fixed moving screens and you can unequip park dunks and stuff like that, man. Really, I don't know, man. Did they leave anything out? They didn't say anything about fixing relentless finishing, which they haven't. And like I said, from what I've seen, a lot of people said that none of this even worked anyway. Like, like we just, we, we, downloaded a four gig placebo that's what i'm hearing a lot of people say i haven't played yet i will play and then we'll get some footage for y'all man and we'll see how they go this video already been longer than what i thought it should have been you guys give me your opinion let me know what you think and uh do you think the pass was even worth it or did we just download a four gig placebo i don't know you let me know and i'm out of here till next time it's your boy jay easy aka fresh from the barbershop bk the people's champ holla 60 out this mug. I told you we just beta testing this game, man. Patch after patch. We just beta testing. That's it.